It says the Shroud of Turin is said to be tetradiplon. It is doubled four times. It is four doubled. There are four sections of the New Testament. New Testament scholars see the fourth revelations as different and not belonging. Revelations is very cryptic and philosophical. Gospels, Acts, Epistles, and Revelations. In Daniel, uh, this is lecture 31 of Quadrant Christianity. In Daniel, Daniel describes four beasts. The four beasts are connected to four kingdoms. The four beasts are also linked to a dream of Nebuchadnezzar. In the dream, there are four components of the statue. The statue of Nebuchadnezzar's dream, head of gold, chest, of, chest and arms of silver, belly and thighs of bronze, legs of iron. In the book of Revelations, the beast is described as the fourth, fourth beast in Daniel's scheme. The beast is a an amalgamation of the previous three. A beast like a lion with eagle's wings is a Babylonian empire. A beast like a bear raised up is a Medo-Persian empire. A beast like a leopard with four wings and four heads is the Greek empire. And the fourth beast with iron teeth is Rome, the Roman Empire. <clears throat> the four major cults. There's a book called The Four Major Cults. The four major cults are Christian Science, Seventh-day Adventists, J, J Witnesses, and the Mormons. The four groups in the Book of Mormon are the Nephites, the Lamanites, the Jaredites, and the Molochites. The Restoration Church of Jesus Christ believes in a quadriune God. Uh, God the Father, Jesus Christ, Holy Spirit, and Heavenly Mother. That's what they believe in. Mormons have a four-year cycle. There are four standard works in the Mormon religion. Year one is the Old Testament. Year two is the New Testament. Year three is the Book of Mormon. And year four is the Doctrine and Covenants. The documentary hypothesis has four parts.